Hey YouTube, what is up everybody? It's your homeboy, 7 4 I am making this video this morning and basically it is my three day weekend, three day week. Um, plus I have off for the holidays and everything else. And so I said, I just turn off the dome light. I don't really like to have a mic. But uh, yeah, it's just, it is what it is. Days this week, the uh, days just started. So really, technically, it's only two days. Uh, but other than that, I can't wait because I'm ready for that four day weekend just to get away from this place. That way, I can just you know, kind of relax, focus on me. And that's what I've been doing, is just focusing on me instead of others. Uh, because me, if I just focus on me, when I see it, um, I don't have. Too much stress. I mean, I don't. I'm not worried about this person. I'm not worried about that person. I'm just worried about me. Sometimes you just gotta do that in life. You know, you just gotta focus on yourself. So you know, focusing on others. You know, you gotta worry about yourself. You know, yeah, it's okay. You know, to help them out in their problems in the once in a while. But they gotta figure out problems on their own. And that's how I see it. And that's how I'm gonna say it and everything else. But it's just the fact that when you tend to see to worry about what other people think, worry about what they have to say. And to me, you know, really typically you shouldn't really worry about what people say. You shouldn't really worry about um, a whole lot of people other than the ones that you're close to. The thing of it is, even the ones that are close to you, and it's still turn around and stab you right in the back. So it's like it's like a double-edged sword because you never know who you're going to end up trusting. So that's another reason why I've been kind of distancing from everybody because I was told from my boss when I went in there and talked to him last, like, you know, said, you know, I'm here to try to make friends and you know stuff like that. You know, I don't want to make enemies on the job. And uh, he was like, well, we're we're not here to make friends. We're here to uh, do our work. You know, you got it backwards. Uh, I said, well, I said I like to make friends while I'm on the job. Well, then after he said that, then I became a real jerk. I hadn't really talked to nobody for about almost two weeks here at work, and I just kind of been distancing myself after he said that. And I was just like, okay, you know, you don't want me to have friends here, you know, I'll just keep quiet. And then if he comes up to me and asks me what's wrong, I just figure, well, I'll just tell him what he said. And if he denies it, and I'll just say, well, he'll do it right there, and I can ask her on it, and she'll back me up on it. And, which is my manager and so basically basically you know I'm still at the same place I'm not happy with this um, but you know it's a job you know I get the weekends off I get insurance I have insurance you know, that's one of the things the reason why I'm working here it's because of the weekends off and the insurance plus it's more of the shifts so I ain't really complaining, it's just that, you know, I just get tired of everybody. You know, when they get a job, you know, they say, oh, they want to quit. They want to threaten to quit. You know, nobody's forcing you to work there at a job. You know, if you don't like a job, just quit it. You know, if you don't, I mean, if you don't like a job, just quit it. You know, why stay there and be miserable the rest of your life? You know, and, you know, working for somebody that you don't really care too much for. And that, that's the thing. And, uh, yeah, even though I can't really have room to talk on that, I haven't quit my job even though I have not liked it. But, you know, it's just because of the people. The people are good to be there. You know, I have, I got respect. And, you know, it's just, uh, but it's just that they won't let me, let my potential shine. And that's what aggravates me the most is that they don't let my potential shine. Like, a, like I want it to do and so when it comes to that part when it 
comes to that part, I I don't like the fact that they end up doing that to me, but other than that, it is what it is. I can't do nothing. Things happen for a reason. So, yeah, I'm just glad it's three days, and um, this week, and I have a four-day weekend, so I can't wait till the next two days to get over with. That way I can be on my four-day weekend. I'm getting off here. So don't